Protecting young carers' futures is a highly relevant theme for Young Carers Action Day and is something that should be at the forefront of our minds throughout the year. Young carers mean so much to so many people and play a vital role right across our society. And I'm keen that today raises awareness of what you want to do. And I also want to assure you that we understand your life and that future careers should be enhanced by your experiences. For many of you, the pandemic has increased the levels of care that you've been required to provide. It is a difficult time and an unprecedented situation, but you have not been forgotten about. We have funded an education officer post at Carers Trust Scotland after listening to concerns from young carers that you don't always feel understood with issues often not recognised by your teachers. The officer works with Education Scotland, Skills Development Scotland, universities and the SQA to raise awareness of how young carers can best be supported and about the incredible skills so many of you have. Now, I also want to emphasise the Young Carers Grant that's available to 16 to 18 year olds. This payment of just more than £300 is available annually. If you received it last year and you're still in age range, it's likely you'll be able to apply again. The payment is for you to spend on whatever you wish and it won't affect the benefit paid to the person that you care for. So if you haven't already, please visit the mygov.scot website if you think you might be eligible to apply. For those not yet old enough to apply for the grant, I would encourage you to make sure that you're signed up to the Young Scot Young Carer Package. This is for all young carers aged 11 to 18 and includes e-vouchers for shops, wellbeing boxes and streaming service subscriptions, to name but a few. Now, I hope that Young Carers Action Day is a success for everyone that's involved in it this year. Thank you for everything that you do. It is appreciated not only by the people that you care for, but also by everyone here at the Scottish Government.